السلام علیکم ان دس ٹوریل وی ول ریزیوم دا اڈاپٹر ورک فار گیٹنگ ویڈیو فائلز ان اے فولڈر ہیو وی گیٹ دا ویڈیو نیم اینڈ سائز ان پریویس ٹوریل ناؤ وی ول گیٹ دا ویڈیو ڈیوریشن اینڈ تھم نیل اف اے ویڈیو فار گیٹنگ دا ویڈیو ڈیوریشن فرسٹ اف آل وی ہیو ٹو گیٹ دا ڈیوریشن ان ملی سیکنڈ یو کین ریموو دس ابو دس لائن وی ہیو ٹو کریٹ ڈبل ویریبل نیم اٹ ایز ملی سیکنڈز ویڈیو لسٹ ڈاٹ گیٹ پوزیشن ڈاٹ گیٹ ڈیوریشن ناؤ ہے پوائنٹ آن دس لائن پریس آلٹ اینٹر وی ہیو ٹو سلیکٹ دا تھرڈ آپشن ریپ یوزنگ ڈبل ڈاٹ پاس ڈبل اینٹر ناؤ دس ویریبل ڈبل ویریبل کنٹین دا ڈیوریشن آف ویڈیو ان ملی سیکنڈ We have to change the milliseconds into hours, minutes and seconds according to the duration of video. For this we have to create a method below this below this view holder class we have to create method public string name it as time conversion take value long type long variable as value now here create a string variable video time int variable name it as duration and equal to value you can point on the value press alt enter cast to int below this line create int variable for hours hrs now here in parenthesis duration divided by total number of milliseconds in an hour total number of seconds in an hour is 3600 if i multiply it to 1000 it will change the seconds of hour into milliseconds now we can write these three zeros with 3600 now these are the milliseconds in one hour create int value for minutes mns again parenthesis duration divided by total number of milliseconds in one minute 60 seconds multiply 1000 is 60000 milliseconds and outside of parenthesis percentage 60000 now here create int for seconds duration percentage 60000 and divide it to 1000 it will change it to seconds now here create if statement if hours if hours greater than 0 means if video have duration more than 1 hour then video time we have to change the video time variable correct the spelling video time video time equals to string dot format we will use this format keep follow the format percentage 02d colon percentage 02d for minutes colon percentage 02d for seconds and here outside of double quotes comma and pass here hours minutes and seconds in else statement if video duration is not greater than 1 hour then video time is equal to string dot format you can copy these two we have to change this to colon not semicolon copy this control c control v if video has duration less than 1 uh, hour then we will use this format 
this 0 to day for minutes and this for seconds and if video duration is more than one hour then this this format we will use one hour minutes and seconds and here outside of double course comma pass here minutes and seconds and below this if statement we will return the video time return video time and now we will use this method time conversion here holder dot video duration dot set text time conversion and here long value we will pass milliseconds here milliseconds point on the milliseconds alt enter we have to cast parameter to long now we will get the thumbnail here for getting the thumbnail we will use glide that is image loading format open chrome right here glide open the first link github.com now below here we have to copy the dependency for glide copy these two lines control C in build.gradle module file here paste and click on sync now now in video file adapter we have to use here glide point on it press alt enter glide dot with context dot load new file video list dot get position dot we have to get path dot into holder dot thumbnail we get the thumbnail and video duration now we will initialize the adapter in video files activity open video files activity here create object for recycler view first and second private array list of media files name it as video files array list is equal to new array list now here take object of video files adapter video file adapter now here recycler view is equal to find view by id r dot id dot videos underscore rv here create method show video files point on the method press alt enter create method now here video files adapter is equal to new video files adapter first variable will be video files array list and second context give this recycler view dot set adapter video file adapter now recycler view dot set layout manager new linear layout manager give context this orientation will be vertical and reverse layout false and at last video folder adapt video file adapter dot notify data set change before initializing the adapter we will keep the video files array list equal to fetch media method point on the fetch media method press alt enter create method now above the return first create array list 
of media files this method will return the video files take the variable as video files new array list now create uri media store dot video dot media dot external content uri take string variable for selection media store dot video dot media dot data for path plus in double quotes give space and write like question mark now here we have to take the string of array type string of array type and here write selection argument variable arg selection arg new string array type here in curly brackets in double course percentage plus we have to write the variable in method in parenthesis write string folder name write here folder name plus in double course write percentage now here we will create cursor get content resolver dot query pass uri first uri now projection will be null selection variable and selection argument variable and sort order will be null selection and selection argument variable will return the video files in a specific folder now create if statement if cursor not equal to null and cursor dot move to next we have to create do while loop do and here while cursor dot move to next in do while loop we have we can copy the code from main activity where we get the folders here we can copy these lines of code copy it in video files activity you can paste here control v now below these lines we have to add media files to video files video files dot add we have to add this variable of model class media files now at the last we have to return video files now above here we have to pass the folder name in fetch media method as we are getting the folder name from video folder adapter here we are getting the folder name using intent we have to copy this key for getting folder name control c copy this and in video files activity first create a variable of folder underscore name below this recycler view folder name is equal to get intent dot get string extra we have to pass the key that we copy from video folder adapter control v and this variable will get the folder name pass it here folder name now also we have to set this folder name on toolbar on toolbar title below this set content right here 
get support action bar dot set title pass the folder name we have to get the folder name above this get support action bar for this we have to cut this line from here and right above the get support action bar if you are not doing this you will surely get error we have to get the folder name before setting it on toolbar now we can run the app our app is installed open it open any folder let's say i open whatsapp video here you can see the thumbnails are not showing but video size duration and video name is showing and also folder name is showing on the title now if you are checking the app on android 9 or below devices then your thumbnail will be show but if you are checking the app on android 10 just like me then we have to change the target api for getting the thumbnail and also we have to change the color of this menu more now for changing the target api version we have to open build load gradle module file above here change the target sdk version to 28 and compile sdk version also 28 point on target sdk version alt enter and we have to add suppress sync now hey remember if thumbnails are showing then no need for changing the api but if thumbnails are not showing as if you checking the app in android 10 then you have to change the sdk version and compile sdk version and also we have to change the color of menu more for this open video item press control and click on ic more here we have to change this to light dark now run the app our app is installed again open it open any folder and here you can see the thumbnails are showing open another folder thumbnails are showing and also the color of menu more if i click on menu more this toast is showing and also you can see the background hover now that's all for this tutorial we will start working on playing the video in exo player from next tutorial until then allah hafiz